Hi there, everybody. Martin Tyler with you. Alan Smith is also joining me today. And it's a game which we're anticipating eagerly, I think, Alan, from the Bundesliga. Yeah, I'm looking forward to this one. It's a match here to really sum up. Dortmund and Schalke, terrific support. It's going to be a wall-to-wall -wall noise here. I think so, looking forward to this. Schalke just trying to keep tabs on Dortmund and Bayern in the Bundesliga. Never easy. It's not the easiest name to shout in a crowded penalty area, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, but we'll do our best because he's bound to do something in a penalty area. Well, I'm sure his teammates have got a nickname for him. I'm sure they've shouted it often enough in celebration because he knows where the back of the net is. Schalke's line-up today, Ralph Farman starts in goal, Benedikt Herbedes starts with Matija Nastasic as the centre-backs. Nabil Bentaleb starts alongside Benjamin Stambouli in the middle of the park. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. This is the Borussia Dortmund lineup. In goal, Roman Berkey. Socrates Papastotopoulos starts alongside Mark Bartra in the heart of defence. Gonzalo Castro plays with Julian Weigel in midfield. And these are the three forwards who'll look to provide the goals. We were here for a Champions League final in 2004. Porto, when it was the first really unveiling of Jose Mourinho in the Champions League stage, he'd won the UEFA Cup as it was the season before, and he uh, took his bow and bowed out. It's a lovely ground, I must say, enjoy visiting it every time, and they get really good support here this working-class area of Germany. Heimo Waschenschneider is the referee today. So we're ready to start. Sit back and enjoy the next 90 minutes of football. Kagawa. Aubameyang. Comes in strongly. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. The cross is on. Probing away. Trying to find room for a shot, maybe. Came in with a challenge. Now Stambouli. Guido Bergstaller. I think it was a foul. The referee straight away has blown for it. Yellow card very early in proceedings here. Not ideal at all for that lad, but he can't have any complaints with the challenge and the decision. Schalke deflected behind a clear corner <laughs> Koke it's gone fantastic start here and they've given themselves a terrific boost for what lies ahead that chance very well taken for Schalke well it was a, a really accurate corner and a fantastic finish by the boy So the first goal, it's 1-0. Here's Socrates Papastatopoulos. Papastatopoulos. 
It's Kagawa. Moving the opposition around with their play, these two players. Well, it was easy on the eye, but in the end, pretty easy to defend against. Tackle goes in. Obama Yang. Mark Batra trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Obama Yang. Very good challenge. Herbides. And the take wasn't very convincing, was it? Peace check. Now Pasla. Papastatopoulos. Julian Weigel. Gonzalo Castro. Peace check. Weigel. Julian Weigel is Socrates Papastatopoulos. Peace check. Bill Bentaleb. Borussia Dortmund on the ball. They've worked hard to get it there. Obama Yang. The teammates who are clearly on the same wavelength. Julian Weigel. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. Makes a challenge here. Schmelzer. It goes towards Alabama Yang. That's a great interception. So it's 1 0 here as the half time whistle goes. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. Referee blows and we're away for the second half with Schalke on the ball. Now Stombuli. Koke. He went in well. There's going to be a throw in after that tackle. That throw has literally tossed possession away. Now Pasla. Papastatopoulos. 
Dembele. Nabil Bentaleb. Saw the pass coming and got there first. Comes in with a tackle. Weigel. Marcel Schmelzer. It's time for Schalke to make this change. Substitution coming up for Schalke. Decided to make a change, and being behind, you can understand that. Daniel Caligiuri. Play goes on with the advantage with Schalke. Matija Nastasic. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. And it's been an hour of very good football here. We've still got 30 more minutes to go, and I'm sure we're going to enjoy that as well. And it's Schalke winning the ball well. Guido Bergstaller. Schupo Motting. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Has to get it into the box. It could be a chance. And they have scored. And they do lead now by two. And they've worked very hard for this. And it should get them across the line at the end of the match. We'll see. Replay confirming for us here that the goalkeeper did get a touch, but not strong enough to keep the ball out of his net. Well, he is his own harshest critic, this lad, and could blame himself for that, I think, having got a touch. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Shaheen. Shaheen. Obama Yang. Chalka substitution coming up. Dortmund trying so hard to get back into the match. Well, the manager on the sidelines has made his intentions clear. He's waving quite a few defenders forward. They're just going to get that ball into the box, whichever way is possible. Well, he's got on the score sheet, hasn't he? And now he's getting off the pitch. It looked like one of those shots that should have been saved. And by the keeper's reaction, I think he agrees too. Johannes Geis. And looking down at that Schalke bench, they are going to bring on a new player. Came in with a challenge. And it takes a nick off the player, out for a throw. And there's action on the Schalke bench. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Schalke trying to attack now. Defender to it first. Going for goal! 
Well, the message from the coach is do not sit back. Keep doing what you've been doing well to be leading in the game. Castro. Pulisic. Peace check. Spotted that well and intercepted. And it's an attack now from Schalke. Makes the challenge here. This could be a chance. And the goalkeeper. It's his ball. Here's Bentaleb. Well, it's an important area to win back the ball, that. Here's Socrates Papastatopoulos. And the time to be added on here is a minimum of three minutes. Obama Yang. Came in with a challenge. Schalke. Chippy! That's in there! Well, I didn't see it as being as one-sided as it's turned out, Martin, but uh, yet another goal and a good one too here in stoppage time. It's another late goal to emphasise the gulf between the two sides today. Yeah, and it's been that type of match. I think everybody out there, the strikers particularly, want to increase the goal tallies, and they've done it. Well, they've widened the margin now. 3-0 they lead. Schalke have won this match. Well, in this great rivalry, one side rose to the challenge and the other has collapsed, really. Well, the losing side really didn't kick a ball in anger. They didn't turn up for this one, and that's surprising, given the importance of this derby. Well, he's had a very good game, hasn't he? Good performance from him, and uh, I think that was probably the difference between the two teams. As for Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang... I think if he'd have been in better form today, we might have had a different result. But the fact is, he was below par, as was his team. Okay. Really trying to use the full width. Of... Has to get it into the box. It could be a chance. Challenge. Schalke said, should be. Oh, it's in there. 